whole contractor engaged by the Department of Environment, Land and Planning uh, down in Victoria to undertake the Mount Martha dredging works. The, the works consisted of beach renourishment of 25,000 cubic metres uh, of beach in and around shacks, around the uh, cliff faces uh, where they've been severely eroded during uh, recent uh, bad weather events. Uh, Hall Contracting selected the dredge, cutter suction dredge Warriba. Uh, Warriba is a small, compact, demandable dredge. Uh, it was mobilised down there because it was the most suitable size. It had previously undertaken works down there in Victoria and proven to be very reliable for the works. It was uh, undertaken on time uh, and as planned and we have an extremely happy client. The project challenges uh, it, it included uh, working within Port Phillip Bay, uh, which can have very unpredictable uh, weather events. Uh, so the guys were able to uh, carefully plan to, to manage around those vents uh, and get through the project without incident. The project involved working around historically sensitive beach shacks that have been established uh, for many years down in, uh, in Mount Martha uh, and, and also the uh, erosion uh, around the cliff face. So there was very um, uh, careful works planned and, and undertaken to ensure that there was no damage to these shacks or the uh, sensitive beach uh, during the works and I'm pleased to say uh, that went off uh, really well. Just due to the complex nature of the project, we needed a very experienced team, but they blended very well with the locals. About 50-50% uh, of local and, and all existing employees. Uh, the local support down there included uh, the, you know, the launching of the dredge of the local marina, uh, the poly welding activities, uh, civil earthworks, labour hire and local hire of a plant as well. So look, it was a good team effort and they uh, pulled it off, which was great. The project had some very sensitive uh, management required and that includes uh, the local um, marine life, uh, which was dolphins and turtles and other marine mammals uh, that live in the bay. Quite regularly there was pods of dolphins that swam around the dredges. From a safety perspective, uh, there were some real challenges down there. Uh, the weather was uh, an ever-changing uh, factor in Melbourne, as everyone knows, um, so hourly that could change. And, and Dan and the crew, including uh, Quervis and Riley, were able to monitor those closely and, and react. And I'm pleased to say we got through the project with no incidents.